Welcome to this presentation from Leica Geosystems. My name is Claire Vanderswag, or better known as the Flying Dutchman. I'm the Reality Capture Manager for Building and Construction here in the U.S. I've been with Leica Geosystems since 2014. I had the pleasure of building a Reality Capture team and business, including 32 professionals. And I love seeing the democratization of point clouds within the AEC space. When we look at that environment, the architectural environment, the engineering environment, and construction environment, there's not a better scanner from an entry level than the BLK360. The BLK360 itself has scan speeds of 360,000 points per second. The level of detail is good at one quarter inch at roughly 30 to 32 feet. In terms of the environment, the scanner is pretty robust with an IP rating of 54. So if it is caught in the rain or snow, the scanner does have an open mirrored system which could cause noisy data. Temperature ranges for the scanner are 41 degrees Fahrenheit to 104 degrees Fahrenheit conservatively. Field registration is cloud to cloud. The max range of the scanner is 60 meters or roughly 200 feet. And the 3D data quality is good. When we look at point cloud data, we look at the level of detail and what it can produce. No matter what the interest is, whether creating a floor plan, a cross section, or an RCP, point clouds are certainly the way of the future and they're here now. It's actually pretty easy to create a quick cross section within AutoCAD, Revit, or Navisworks with point cloud data. So the BLK360 is very simple with a one button push operation. Scanning again is 360,000 points per second with a range of 60 meters. And the system includes an invisible infrared laser which is a class one laser and I say for everybody. The results are instant with live imagery and scan data streaming via Wi-Fi. Typical capture time is three minutes for a complete reality capture, including imagery, thermal and scan data. The scanner is very independent. There's no cables required. Storage for the scanner is approximately 100 scans or reality captures. Battery life is 40 plus scans or reality captures with approximately two, two and a half hours of battery life. And the scanner can certainly be operated indoors or outdoors. When connecting the scanner to the tripod, there's a one button push operation which secures the scanner for mounting upright, sideways, or upside down, depending on the application you're in. Software options for the scanner include the following. BLK360 with awesome software equals happy customers and a whole lot of value. So to achieve this, we look into our Leica Geosystems laser scanning software suite. This suite includes four softwares, including Cyclone, Cloudworks, Jetstream, and TrueView. From field to finish, these softwares will ensure quality and accuracy throughout the process. So from field to finish, the first process is capture itself. Using the Cyclone Field 360 application, we connect to our scanners and operate them remotely. This can be used on your phone. This can also be used on a tablet. We download the information or data directly into Cyclone Register 360 via Wi-Fi. 
We use different technologies such as TrueView and Jetstream to share this information with as many people as possible. In terms of consume, consuming the data and delivering the data, we create amazing deliverables for your customer. And we can also share that content quickly and safely. Let's look at a few of these deliverables and applications. The first, of course, is as-built data, or collecting existing conditions for renovation, 3D modeling, and design. Imagine a building without plans, blueprints, or any type of digital assets. Going out and laser scanning sites is easier and better than ever. Another great application is capturing MEP spaces for coordination. Imagine capturing a space like this, modeling 3D assets. In this case, we've got fire protection, some MEP elements, and then using it for your design model and coordination while overlapping data and geometry. Another is architectural skins and panels for existing conditions for building skins, etc. We all know buildings aren't built perfectly. Some structural features, including columns, support systems, may have undulation or unforeseen type environments. Capturing these environments via a point cloud allows for prefabrication offsite to be very accurate and thorough. Scanning for floor flatness and analysis. Now we've got data that can be consumed and create deliverables of value with elevation mapping. In this case, we've got different colors which change by elevation and the difference is a quarter inch between the colors. Collecting as-built data for concrete, formwork, embeds prior to a concrete pour. This enables automated comparison with the models to detect deviations and etc. Sleeves, Post-tension cable systems all come into play while scanning concrete work. As built in construction and milestones, especially in this COVID-19 environment that we're all experiencing, scanning data above the ceilings, uh, in the walls, under slabs, really is, it's a, it's a risk management or risk mitigation type operation. Imagine sharing this information with owners, with architects, with engineers, those that are working remotely and don't go to the site. Reality capture is extremely important through the entire process of construction. Validation to ensure construction placement of materials is accurate. In this case, we've got pipes that were placed in, in the incorrect location compared to the 3D model. This, in fact, could, could, could cause a conflict with fire protection or other assets that are in the area. And then finally, sharing point cloud data on any device, including phones, tablets, computers, is easier than ever. Allowing those who have never experienced a point cloud, such as a VP, an owner, etc., the ability to open a point cloud, measure, annotate is now something that can be achieved easily through TrueView Global. I hope you've enjoyed the presentation. At this point, we'll hand it over to the professionals for hands-on and questions. Thank you for your time.